Mm-mm-mm-mm. Look at this. This looks so delicious, y'all. You wanna know how I made this BLT on croissant? Come on, get into this video, y'all. Just come on, get on into this video. Get into this video, y'all. Get into this video. Vlog. I'm back again with another video. How are you guys today? Oh, I love this angle. It's finally looking good. Y'all, this is my new tripod I'm working with. Thank you all for coming back to see what T-Vlog is doing again. Thank you. But before we get into this video, y'all know what I need you to do right here. Yeah, just hit it. Hit that notification bell. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Hit a thumbs up as well. Leave a comment down below. Thank you all for coming back to see what I'm doing. Okay, y'all. So I went to our local grocery store and my friend is here with me from Oklahoma and we're going to get up and get some breakfast on. So we just wanted a little sandwich. We're going to get some of this bacon on. Y'all know I still got some of it off the mind. Bacon, y'all, that was still on sale for $2 a pack. We're going to put this here. Yes, this bacon here. And we're going to make some BLTs this morning, okay, y'all? Bacon, lettuce, and tomato. But we ain't going to do it on no bread, y'all. We, I went to my local, we went to our local um, price shoppers, and she picked us up some uh, hey, croissants. So we're going to get these BLT croissant sandwiches going. And she everyone see me, I like to be a little slick. So I like a little egg on mine, okay? So we're going to turn me over an egg on mine. And we got them fresh tomatoes and of course, you know, she wants some folders coffee, okay? So, we still yet unpacking everything, but let me get into this video. Okay, y'all, show you so what I'm doing, all right? Is, okay. We're going to get this iron on, and then I'm going to go ahead and start cutting, cooking this bacon on up. So, let's get this bacon in the pan. Right, right. So, it's enough of us eating this bacon, so we're going to just go ahead and cook this bacon up. I could have easily put it in the oven, but I just don't feel like putting the oven on. It's kind of warm outside, so I just really just go ahead and fry it up in this pan here. And uh, then I'm going to get some, get the tomatoes cut up, you know, slices of tomato sliced up and stuff. <laughs> and I'm going to get the lettuce together, you know what I'm saying, so... Let's get this bacon all laid up in here. And uh, I'm going to cook it just like that there. So, I made this rest of bacon in here. So, it can start cooking. And then we're going to go ahead and uh, come back and show you what I'm going to do with these. Uh, tomatoes okay so we're gonna get this cooked up and just come back okay y'all so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna use my cutter and i'm gonna slice my tomatoes i think you're on friend two on number two which will be hold on let me, let me. Yeah. Oh, this one here is kind of well, I'm going to have to, well, yeah, I'm going to kind of soft. It's tomato kind of soft. So, let me come back. You want to slice them another way. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to just cut it with this knife here, is knife? We're just going to slice them. And it's still like a two on the tomato, because you want to taste your tomato. So, and we're just going to just eat slice Sometimes it might come out a little thick, but that's okay. I ain't going to hurt myself, y'all. I ain't hurt myself. Don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Right. My uh, friend says she like she ain't a whole tomato, so that's what we gonna do. We just gonna slice these right on up. Get these ready to go on the sandwiches. And so I'm gonna put them off into this bowl here. <coughs> <coughs> I put the hand over there because I use those hands. Okay. There we go. So we're gonna come back and cut this cut this pineapple up right here and come back. Okay. So what I'm doing now, y'all, is I'm cutting the croissants. Look how good and fresh those croissants are. 
and they had just made them and freshened them up. They were just getting ready to put them out. So we caught them right when it was just made, nice and warm. They had just had them on the cooling rack. So I'm putting base to top. We're going to save the last one for the later. And I'm going to eat a sandwich. Ooh, they're good and soft. Base to top. Base to top. And so we're going to base to top. Okay? So now, I'm going to go ahead and get these buttered up so I can toast them in the, on top. And then I'm going to put me and uh, a egg, so on top of our salad. So we have base to top. Okay? All right, let's come back. Okay, y'all, we're getting this bacon crisp up real good. Look at these nice little crispy strips of bacon that will be going on these sandwiches. Ooh, these croissant sandwiches, y'all. Ooh, how many of y'all like bacon and tomato sandwiches? Y'all know me. I love to put a little egg on mine. Let me run this water so I can gather up this bacon. Put it over here. This is nice and crispy. We got one more batch of bacon to cook. Let's put this last batch of bacon in. And then we're going to come back and show you how I'm cutting this uh, pineapple. Okay, y'all got my bag here for the skins. And I got my bowl here. I'm going to put it on this side some pineapple. Okay, so let's, let's get to cutting this pineapple. Y'all know what I do. I'm going to go straight down in the middle. I'm going to start going around. I'm chopping it down. You don't have to cut. <laughs> and then, I'm going to cut all the way around the top. <laughs> and cut the top off. And I'll store these because I make my pineapple tea. My picture is still in my refrigerator. So I just gotta make some more pineapple tea. And I'll just go around. Okay, I'll come back show you the sound. Uh, use some extra virgin, organic extra virgin olive oil. Fry in the skillet. I'm gonna crack me and DD an egg up in here. <coughs> I'm gonna wash the pan and I'm gonna do this first. I'm gonna bust her yolk, but my yolk gonna stay whole. Just let this go ahead and cook. 
and get brown and crispy and then I'm gonna flip them and we're gonna flip okay <laughs> now while these are cooking and getting ready to brown because we want them a little crispy around the edges we are going to go ahead and start <laughs> you know putting a little mayo on these brown these uh croissants and browning them in here and then let's do it Okay, y'all, so we got the lettuce prepared, okay? So now we're going to use condiments. Dee wants this on her, so we're not going to put on hers. We're going to put, uh, yeah, so I'm going to lay this, her, hers on the side of here. And me and my sis, we are going to have mayo. Now I'm going to toast mine with just a little light mayo. Just a little light mayo on mine. Okay. This is my top. This is my top and this is my bottom. So, I'm going to rub a little mayo on top of mine. And then I'm going to toast it on top of the stove. Okay. Now, I'm my sister, if she wants to. Do you want yours toasted, Joe? No, you don't have to it. I don't have a problem with it. That's what I do. That's what I do. <laughs> okay, so we got them ready for toasting. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and pick these up and show you hers. <clears throat> I'm going to slide this out of our jurisdiction. We'll come back with the knife, clean it off real good. And let me show you how I'm gonna make hers. Okay, so now I'm adding the strawberry gel to Dee Dee's. Now, to you, whatever your preference is, that you make your BETs, your B BLTs, I said BETs, y'all. I mean BLTs, that would be great. You know, use what's your preferences. You know what I'm saying? But this is hers. She wants that strawberry jam on there. And so now I'm going to go in and uh, get her bacon and her eggs. So here's that bacon. Good crispy bacon. We're going to just lay some on there on this, on this bread for her. And hook her up with the crisp, crisp bacon. Uh oh, no, you ain't going nowhere. You are not going nowhere. <laughs> and there we go. Me and my, me and my friends, we have to ride. <laughs> and then she wants that crispy egg on top. We got that little crisp, crisp egg on top. And bam. We got the B. B. Well, this ain't no BLT because it's B. BG <laughs> BGT <laughs> This is Dee Dee's, okay? Let me come back with her. Last step to this simple sandwich. These are the ones with the mayo on it, okay? I'm just gonna take it down in there and I'm just gonna just let it get a little brown. Okay? When it gets a little brown, then we just gonna come back and uh make those sandwiches. <laughs> we got the bacon already separated for her, her sandwich. Mine's gonna have eggs. Okay. Since I got some provolone cheese, do you want any of that on yours? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. There we go. Got a little crisp on it. There we go. There we go. <laughs> okay. So this was mine. I think I'm just gonna crisp mine. Have mine a little soft. So. Okay. And we're coming back. Okay, so I'm gonna make my sister's snack. This is hers. And I'm just gonna add a slice of provolone cheese to hers. Put a slice of mine. We're just going to go ahead and add this lettuce on in there. 
I'm gonna cut that lettuce up over there like that, y'all. And she just wants to eat LT. And while we cut the little lettuce up right there, this eats tomatoes out. <laughs> We're gonna add some tomatoes all to the sandwich because she loves tomatoes, y'all. Look at that. Nice slices of red tomatoes, y'all. I'm gonna add some tomatoes to mine too, y'all. I ain't had a BLT in a long time. So I'm going to add some of the crispy piece of bacon on the opposite side of the bread. Okay. And so I'm going to try to get into this. Get into it. Get into it. And this here is a nice BLT. Check it out. Okay. We're going to lay that bacon and tomatoes on top of there. And there we go. If you enjoy watching me make these, like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, hit a thumbs up as well, leave a comment down below, and let me know how you like these crisp, nice, good, crispy BLTs on croissants, y'all, okay? All right. Thank you. Peace and belief. Don't forget to have grease. See ya.